Vítejte na mém YouTube kanálu, uh, welcome on my YouTube channel. Uh, this video will be in English, or in my Czech English, better to say, so I hope you will understand. And uh, also I must say, uh, this video is for the totally beginners in audio technic only. Uh, the experts know everything, everything better than me, uh, but uh, I receive, I can say, every day a question, uh, can I uh, connect my smartphone, my tablet, my PC to a very old amplifier? So, see, see these videos, see this video, and I would like to show show it to you how to connect it and it's uh, I can say very 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 simple and also very very cheap uh, as you can see is on the table an old uh, old amplifier it's in I can say bad condition uh, it's Fisher studio standard by Fisher uh, from the beginning 80s uh, last century and uh, as I can say every old amplifier, not every, but the most of old amplifiers, it has from the backside this RCA connectors, input connectors, RCA or Cinch. Uh, where, can, where have I this, for example? I'm sure that uh, everybody of you knows such a such a signal cable. So this is classic Cinch or RCA. This is the exact exact name of this of these connectors. So, and I can say every PC, maybe every tablet, and also uh, maybe every smartphone has a headphone connector. Uh, the 3,5 millimeters jack. Oh, I must say, not every smartphone, because as you sure know, the new iPhones, they don't have it. So, I don't know now how to connect iPhone with such a, such a <coughs> amplifier, but uh, all of other smartphones, they have such a such a connector so it is uh, i can say very very simple you need only this very simple and very cheap cable on one side the 3.5 millimeters stereo jack for for head headphones for example and on the other side the two uh, rca cinch connectors you put in any of inputs, any of inputs, but not uh, phono input, because phono input has built-in phono preamplifier, so uh, the signal will be then too strong. So you can put it uh, into the AUX CD tuner, and now I have it uh, into the tape uh, tape input. One end of the cable. Second end of the cable, click, play. Because uh, I think I'm not not IT expert, but I think that uh, all of PCs, all of computers have also headphone uh, jack 3.5 connector. You can connect it also to the uh, each PC. I think that uh, every tablet maybe uh, have also also such a connector. Uh, but uh, it can happen uh, that uh, you have an older amplifier. For example, this German RFT. This is. <laughs> this is not older. This is this is not older. 
Nee, 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 nee. This is uh, from the year uh, 88. So I think this, this is older. But never mind. This German amplifier is German amplifier. Let's see. Hifi Stereo Verstärker VEB Stern Stern Radio Sonneberg. And you can see that you cannot see here the uh, cinch, the RCA connectors. But you can see here the DIN5 input connectors. DIN5, this one, so no problem to connect it also. So, so you need only the cable with uh, DIN5 on one side and with uh, jack 3.5 on the other side. It's uh, no problem to combine it with uh, other, uh, other connectors uh, <coughs> if you have some professional amplifier uh, with old professional amplifiers uh, which have on the back side uh, the professional jacks input connectors so you will use any other connector so it's not uh, no no problem and it's uh, very very simple and uh, at the beginning of the video i told that uh, it is cheap so dear friends such a such a cable I have just looked on <coughs> internet on eBay. So if I don't forget, I put here, put here the uh, uh, short short video of photos uh, because the price of su such a such a cable is one dollar, one buck and eight cents only. Free shipping. So it's no problem to buy it. Uh, to buy the DIN5 with Jack, it's uh, much more expensive. It's about three bucks. So, dear friends, uh, I hope that it, this video can be a little, little helpful for the people who would like to connect their uh, smartphone with an old amplifier and don't they don't don't know how. And uh, you can also see my previous video how to connect. Um, how to connect the turntable to, to an amplifier, uh, previous videos uh, about the sensitivity of the speakers, uh, how works the capacitor condenser in the speaker crossover, how works the coil in the speaker crossover, and other, other, other how to refurbish the speaker cones, uh, how to pull out the uh, speaker dust caps, and other. And all of these videos are in the playlist tips and tricks uh, here on my YouTube channel. So if I don't forget, I put here some active uh, active links to this video, so you will find it in the playlist tips and tricks on my YouTube channel. So thank you for your attention. Thank you.